No, you're clearly going to tryouts. You can't follow us. We're not here to help the competition. She doesn't look like that much competition. I mean, I could be competition, I think. Oh, yeah? So let's go. We're late. Thank you. I'm, I'm going to save mine for later. Huh. You're married. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, I, of course I am. Huh. What does your Freddie think about you going to play baseball? Oh, uh, well, Charlie, um, super excited about it. Yeah, when I was first scouted, I wasn't sure if I was going to come because I have a lot of responsibilities at home, you know, but I've always loved baseball more than anything. I mean, except Charlie, obviously. <laughs> but, I mean, it's just a tryout. It's just a tryout, and it's a free ticket to Chicago, so, and I've never been here. This is really boring. This is nuts. I mean, we could be pros. It's nuts. I mean, some of the games I listen to happen right here. I think the Cubs are playing here tomorrow. What? Yeah. <sighs> no pressure. No pressure. This was just the lucky one. Damn. Is this your guy? Yeah. Oh my goodness. He's handsome. Yeah. He looks a little boring, though. No, he's not. He's not boring. He's really funny and weird in a good way. Whatever happens with this thing, however long it lasts, let's rob the bank. Sound good? Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. You mean that we should take advantage of, of all this and like, do whatever we want and not uh, actually rob a bank? You're saying that <laughs> if I found a job for us to pull, you uh, wouldn't do it? I would have to really think about where I stood. Uh. Um, so he's never said anything explicit about it, but I think that Charlie really likes my hair long. I was thinking like this. Greta, that is so much hair. Do you want me to stop? No. No. Okay, good. I've never met anyone like you. Well, I've never met anyone like you. I'm sure that you have. Uh-uh. Some of that stuff you said in your letter last night. I know. All right, okay, just tell me what I wrote. I think you know what you wrote. What did you tell me? Going. I'm uh gonna show Danny here some of the sites. Peter. Oh. I'm Peter. Uh, but you don't even know the sites you just got here. Um, I feel like maybe I can find something that he can look at. See you back at the barracks. Are you sure it's a good idea? You, you just met him. It's sweet of you to worry, but I can take care of myself. Night. Still giving me the silent treatment, or is that ended? Did you get home okay last night? I'm just trying to focus on playing ball. Can you please just leave me alone? You don't want to be left alone. Yes, I do. <sighs> he said the league won't even last two weeks. We're lucky. You haven't unpacked anything. Okay. They get to tell us how long this lasts and what we wear and what our eyebrows look like and they get to tell us whether or not we can talk back to the <laughs> assholes in the stands, but they don't get to tell us whether or not this is real, that's us. Maybe we could try, um, I don't know, be just friends. Friends can mean a lot of different things. Yeah, like so many. <laughs> In this case, I think maybe just like real friends like this so we can talk about stuff. And then, then we wouldn't do anything else. Things that friends don't usually do. 
Oh, right. I remember now. Those things. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. Friends can mean a lot of different things. Stop it. I do not like you. Stop. What? I'm normal. Stop. Or maybe you're just an asshole. Greta. You know what, Cheryl? Why don't we go hang in the bar and leave these two lovebirds alone? Oh, but shoot. Carson, rules are rules, right? And unfortunately, we got those rules. We've got to stay. So maybe you guys should just sit here and try to be normal. Never been on a date with three women before, so <laughs> it's an experience. <clears throat> I'd let you stay. You were the one who said you wanted to just be friends. This is your fault. You kissed me. You did this to me. I was fine before I met you. You were not fine, and you know it. What do you want from me? What? Do you want me to say that I'm jealous? That I have feelings for you? Fine, I do. Finally. But I have a life. I have a husband. I, I, I can't just burn it down. I meant what I said. I'm not like you, Greta. You're really beautiful. You know that? No, you are. Just take it. No. Yeah, especially when you're eating that sausage. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Thanks for believing in me. I don't know if anyone's ever done that before. The pleasure's all mine. Whenever I'm starting something new with someone, I always like to make sure that I'm seen on a man's arm. Does that make sense? Yeah. It's just one of the rules that I have to keep myself safe. But you like him. Yeah. Yeah, I, I love him. But I think I might love her too. Can't believe I said that outside my own head. I can't either. <laughs> but listen, I was thinking about it. I'm going to take you out on that date. Next time we have a night off, I'll take you somewhere special. Really? That'd be okay? I think so. Okay. Okay. How about this? If we win, you have to come to the bar, okay? <sighs> okay. Yeah. If we win, I will go to the bar with you. You said it. I said it out loud. I know. Oh, shit. Oh, you gotta go. We follow the rules now. No exceptions, I promise. What are you talking about? We have two weeks left. Are you gonna come with me to California? You gonna do that, like you said? Are you telling me that you're gonna leave your husband and your comfortable life for this? For me? You could come with me to New York. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah, I think I am. <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> I mean, how would that work? I don't really know, but 
My train leaves tomorrow. I'm, I'm... I had to do that one more time before you left.